Woodward. What's going on guys today? We're gonna hop in the Hellcat and head down to Woodward for some pictures and some rollers. We got my buddy Coffee here, Coffee's Garage. Go subscribe to him on YouTube, Coffee68 on Instagram. He's got a brand new fifth gen Cummins on some 22 by 14 forged wheels. Got this thing all cleaned up, looking good. We're about to hop in the cars now and uh, head down there. We're gonna meet up with another one of our buddies, Aaron. He's got a red 6.4 uh, Power Stroke. Uh, his, uh, his YouTube channel is 66 Motorsports. Uh, we're gonna go uh, meet up with him, get some video and rollers of our new setups this year, and uh, just enjoy this nice weather we have here in Michigan. It's about 60 degrees outside, and uh, we're gonna make a, make a run for it and uh, get out of the house. We've been cooped up for too long, so stay tuned. All right, guys, so we made a little pit stop here. Ran into my buddy Aaron, 66 Motorsports. Make sure you guys go subscribe to his channel. I'll put a link in the description below. Check out his 64 Power Stroke on some 24 by 14 American Force wheels. Forged, polished. Man, these things are sick. This thing's on an 8 inch lift. Pretty big truck. You got my car rolling with the big trucks tonight. Check out these lug nuts he's got on his forces. They're red spikes. I think that's sick. Contrast off the red truck. Badass wheels, he just polished them. Make sure you go check out his videos. He does a lot of truck content as well. He's trying to get his YouTube channel up and going. I ride Harleys with him as well. He's gonna have some Harley content. I was down in Daytona with him. So these are my buddies here. We got Coffee and Aaron. Coffee's channel's uh, Coffee's Garage, obviously and his is 66 motorsports we're just trying to get these guys up to a thousand subs and uh, we're gonna have a bunch of killer content this summer coming uh, after all this coronavirus bull crap goes over but we got the hellcat here no plate yet using my temp plate right now outside of the car because my windows are so dark the plate doesn't show through the window so i just uh laminated it put it on the back of the car so i don't get messed with even though i probably will get messed with uh, because of the tint but whatever um, we've got the tinted tail lights, as you guys could see in my last video. I actually added this uh, rear spoiler on the back of the window here. What do you guys think of that? Comment down below, let me know your thoughts. I really like it. Um, it adds a little, you know, pop to the car. I'm going to also be wrapping the roof satin black, so it'll flow real good because it's a satin uh, spoiler. So. That's about it for uh, what's new. Um, if you guys saw my last video, I tinted the side markers, I uh, did the emblems, and then obviously tinted the windows. But that's pretty much it so far for the Hellcat. Then we got my buddy's comments here. As I mentioned before, Coffee's Garage, go like and subscribe. So yeah, he's got a lot of plans with this. This isn't his setup. This is just his temporary setup. It's leveled on 22 by 14s. He's doing a big like SEMA build on this truck. He's gonna be doing a lot of powder coat underneath. He's gonna be putting like 26s or 28s on it. Um, so make sure you stay tuned to his channel. He's gonna have a lot of content coming with this Ram. So if you're here for Ram content, you definitely wanna subscribe to him. He's gonna be uh, having a lot of stuff done to this truck. He's actually gonna be doing it too. We actually just installed some rock lights in here. Uh, I don't know if you can see them. Right there, there they are. We got three rock lights in here. They're not quite wired up just yet, but we did that the other night in my garage. But uh, anyway, we're out here, staying six feet away from each other, corona free. We're gonna go enjoy this nice weather while we have it because tomorrow's supposed to rain, so stay tuned. Hopefully we can catch a race tonight in the Hellcat, I don't know. We got some cars here. Who showed up? Check out this GT500, guys. Yeah. Looks so good in white. Love the hood on these cars. Mean front end on them. only got like a hundred miles on it
All right, guys, so we just got down to Woodward. Met up with Motor Tube and the Mustang. We got another Mustang over here. Is this a 20? Yeah. Brand new off the lot. The red looks really good on this car. The black accents, the black wheels, black stripe, tinted shield, looks good. We're out here just social distancing. We got the trucks over here. Got an R8 at the light. Check out Coffee's Garage on YouTube. We just put these rock lights in. Coffee 68 on Instagram. We got my buddy Aaron's truck over here. I just added the uh, Do Work Production sticker to the back of the Hellcat. Something a little clean and nice to add there. So yeah, we're just down here chilling. Not much else to do, can't go in anywhere. Five minutes later. Well, that didn't last long. Alright guys, so we're down here on Woodward. We found a race tonight. We got Motor Tube Ron here. He's gonna be my counter and my videographer for tonight. We got my dad's demon over here. Tons of cars out here on Woodward tonight, guys. But uh, anyway, uh, this Corvette Grand Sport with heads cam and basically probably makes 3,100 pounds. Yeah, 3,100 pounds. 1,500 pounds, 1,500 lighter than. Yeah. So my car weighs 4,600 pounds, big heavy boat. But anyway, we're gonna give it a try. I haven't really raced anything with my car yet. I don't have my tires. I'm on stock tires right now. Here, I'll go to this side. As you can see here, stock tires, Pirellis, they suck. I spin at 40, 60 rolls, but anyway, we're gonna get it done. All right, guys, so here's the Grand Sport I'm gonna be running tonight. C6 Grand Sport to automatic on stock tires as well. Good looking car, it's got the silver stripe. Sorry the lighting's really bad out here tonight, but anyway, here's the Grand Sport. Heads, cam, intake, tune. It's a lot lighter than the Hellcat. It only weighs 3,100 pounds. My car weighs 4,600 pounds, so it'll be a good matchup. It should be a pretty good race. Yeah, trying to let that, cop, that guy go though. Trying to let that car go. We're letting him go. Huh? We're letting that car go. Let me get in front of you guys. Let's, no, we're good. Let's do 40. All right, come on. Came with that W.
They sound so good. You guys gonna do the loop? guys so we're back at home in the garage got the hellcat home safe and sound as you guys saw in tonight's video we found some action for the hellcat we had a fun night perfect weather good times with good friends i gotta say the hellcat did pretty good for being bone stock i'm talking bone stock even on stock tires my stock 305 pirelli p0s in the rear as you can see here no drag radials so no excuses um, just a bone stock wide body hellcat and I just hit a thousand miles on it, so things like brand new. Um, but stay tuned for more content. I will have tons of mods coming for this car, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. But it's late, and I'm tired. Road Glide looking good over here as well. But uh, anyway, yeah, it's late. I'm tired. Got to work in the morning, so we're going to call it a night. If you like the video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button. I greatly appreciate all your support on the channel. I wouldn't be able to do this without you guys. Make sure you guys also follow me on Instagram at dowerkmotorsports, all one word. I'll leave it up here on the screen for you. Um, I post a lot of different pictures and videos on there, more than I do on YouTube. Um, I try to keep that updated daily. So make sure you guys follow me on that as well. But that's going to do it for tonight. Hope you guys liked the video, and I will see you guys on the next one. Peace. Oh,